I am making a different kind of fry for a different kind of a burger. I'm using carrots and parsnip. Now, I don't think people really use parsnip as much as they should. It is the most incredible vegetable. You can roast it, you can puree it, and it's got this sweetness, yet this earthiness, and it lends itself beautifully to fries. Now, for these fries, which I'm gonna make really healthy, no deep frying or anything, I'm just gonna roast them in the oven. I am mixing up the carrot and the parsnip, but it's important that in order to get that satisfaction of a fry, which is like that crispy thing next to your hamburger. I'm cutting these pieces very, very small. So I'm being very careful as I look down on my board and cut. So this little tiny part down here, they're a little tougher to, to cut than the carrot because they're quite fibrous. So just be careful when you're cutting. And then this piece is just so, sort of gets so much fatter that I just fold it securely with my fingers and my fingers tucked under and a nice sharp knife and be very careful. And then you're just slicing off kind of big matchsticks. And the reason we get them this small is so that in the oven, when that heat hits them, it doesn't take too, too long for them to really suck up the seasoning and really get nice and golden and, and be at like a kind of, you know, fake fry, if you will. All right, this is great. So I'm just gonna put it here on my pan and mix them up. Oven roasting vegetables, if you don't already do it, is just fantastic. It brings out the sugars. I know that my kids' vegetable eating really changed when I started making sure that I was roasting the vegetables. So now we just need olive oil. I know that when I started oven roasting vegetables, it became a whole new thing. Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, you name it, and they just gobbled it up. I couldn't cook enough. So you wanna coat this generously with olive oil. And then you want about a half a teaspoon of salt. Be a little generous with the salt here, because trust me, it's not nearly as much salt as you've got if you're buying uh, fast food fries. And then some red pepper flakes is a nice way to switch up your seasoning. And besides, the little red flakes look really nice with the, the orange of the carrot and the parsnip. So I have my oven preheating to 400 degrees, and you just pop them in the oven. In 20 minutes, these will be like fries. Are they ready? Yes, they are. Thin, crispy, delicious. See, it's worth that work to cut them up so that they're small. Mm. Wow. I'm telling you, parsnips are the thing.